welcome to our channel. In this session, we will discuss the concept of standard tree. Standard tree is an ordered tree used to represent a set of strings. At the time of representation of a string, you have to follow something. The root node does not contain any character. So, the root node must be null. The root node must be null. A node can contain a node can contain maximum of 26 children. Maximum of 26 children. And remember the standard tray is an order tray. That is children of a node are arranged in alphabetical order that is in sorted order alphabetical order now in a path from a path from root node to root node to external node or some leaf node a path from root node to leaf node compulsory gives a string in the given set. Suppose I am given a set of strings. If you consider a path from the root node to the leaf node, it has to generate a string that is to be available in the set. So these are the some of the properties. Actually the try and the standard try almost follows the same procedure. Now we will discuss one example how to construct a standard try. Consider some set of strings. So consider some set of strings like this. B, well, B, good, but, set, stock, store. So these are the strings. Now how to construct initially the root node is null. Now the root node, the null contains maximum how many children? It is the very simple logic. Observe the set of strings. What are the starting letters of the set of strings? These are the strings that starts with B. These are the strings that starts with S. That means only two different starting letters. The root node contains only two children. B, yes. That means, I think you know this one. What is the meaning of this one? The set of strings that have common prefix shape the same ancestor. Common prefix. What is mean by prefix? For example, if my string is welcome, what are the prefixes? W, W, E. W E L W E L C W E L C O W E L C O M Finally W E L C O M E All these are prefixes. If any two strings have common prefix, no need to write the tree once again. The strings with the same prefix share the same ancestor. That is the reason. We are representing many number of strings in a simple path. Now B. Okay. Now in B, we have different strings. Which string is to be represented first? Why? Because in the rules we said that the strings are arranged in alphabetical order. That is the children of a node arranged in alphabetical order. Simply all are B's. This is yes. So B is the small letter. First B and then yes. B. B, 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 okay. Then check the second character. Here the second character E, E, I, U, U. Among these two, what is the minimum one? E is the minimum one. Again, with E, we have two strings. In this case, search for third character, I think. Until we have to find 
search for the corresponding character. The third character is A. The third character is L. Now, A and L. Small one is A. So, first we have to construct the string for B, E, A, L. The string is completed. And then obviously the second one is B, E, L, L, L. B, E is already constructed. Simply write down L. That is, these are the two strings that share the common prefix BE. So, BE is constructed only one time. Now, so these two completed. This is the string I, U, U. So, I is the small one and there is no string that again contains I. So, simply common prefix is only B. So, from B, I and G. Now see this one B U L L. Here this character is L. This character is G. Obviously G is the small one. B U G. This is completed. Now finally this one B U L L. B U is already we have L and then L and then L. Okay. These are the strings that are starts with B. Now move to this one. Remember, even though they are not given in alphabetical order, you have to arrange in alphabetical order. Set, stock, stone. So, all are begin with S. Yes. The next character E, T, T. So, E is the small one. So, obviously, S, yes, E, T. This is completed. Now, S, T, T is match. Again, check the third character. Third character is O, O. O is also matched. And then fourth character. Fourth character C and N. So C is the small one. So here the only common thing is S. So that is the reason. S, T, O, C, K. And then for the last string. S, T, O is common. S, T, O is common. N, E. Now. Consider a path. The path from root node to external node gives the string. For example, identify the string bell. B, E, L, L. Identify the string stone. Null to S, T, O, N, E. Okay. This is the way. Generally, the end of a string is represented with dollar. This is the way to construct standard train. In the next session, we will discuss how to construct a compressor train along with their compact representation.